All right, here, my friends. I'm at Powell's Training Center right here off Connell Rock Road. Uh, I came down uh, from this direction by Eastman. Took a ride on Connell Rock. This is about two and three quarter miles from my house, maybe three at the max. There, I think that's the Powell's Distribution Center over here. I'll, like I said, this is Connell Rock Road. I think that's Powell's dis Distribution Center. And this over here, this backside, where this building is right here is the training center. This is Powell's Sudden Service Training Center. I didn't know this building was back here. And I knew the distribution center was, but I didn't know this building was. See right here? <clears throat> training center. Powell's Sudden Service Training Center. Sonja's in the car waiting on me. I'm fixing to go try to film some a horror short a short horror film. That's a uh, Frenchy fries being poured from a container. This is the double the double big pal. Let me see. It's called the double big pal with cheese. See right there. Hamburger. That's two pieces of meat, I guess. This is the cheese. Double big pal with cheese will make you say please. When you know a noisy train is going to come by. The other day I was trying to get footage of a train video. <clears throat> I do a little brief video. This is Powell's Shake. Sorry about bumping my hand against the camera so bad. This is Powell's Shake. 1956 was the first Powell's in Kingsport. And on Revere Street, where I did the video the other day. Talking about the passing of Pals and the first restaurant. So now I'm at the Pals Training Center. I know I don't like to face the sun because it can mess the footage up. And I love these old antiquated looking light poles. So this is where they trained the employees. Now we know. Pretty trees. Evergreens. This is the back side of the building. This is the building. This is what it looks like. I'm going to hurt, go ahead and leave soon. I will go over here and show you the light pose. I love these. These look like the light, old light pose that I saw in Gate City when I was doing my video. The walk around. You like them too, my friends? And I'm not sure what this building is. <clears throat> it's about 520, so I've got to hurry if I'm going to do a horror film. It's little bays back there. I guess that's where to keep supplies. Three doors. All right. This pretty much will do it. Powell's Training Center. It's about three miles, like I said, max from my house. Now, like I said, I knew the distribution center was here. I think that's what that call is called. You can see the uh, trailers that semis pull, pull tractor trailers. You see the trailer on the back. We're up to the loading dock. It says Powell's. It's pretty neat, wouldn't you agree? It's where they trained employees. That's the office. The office. And that's the training center door. So right here this says office. Office. Corrugated steel, looks like. It is. Like drainage ditches have. That's pretty cool. I like this building. It's pretty neat. And over here we have a fork with two Frenchy, uh, Frenchy fries on it. And the reason they call their, their fries Frenchy fries in place of just fries or French fries is because Powell's, when he used to pull up, when Fred, Fred Powell Burger used to pull up <clears throat> and order fries, 
from restaurants, he would say, give me Frenchy fries. I take some of those Frenchy fries. And so his friends and all that heard it and they liked it. And so he named his fries Frenchy fries. Now you know the rest of the story, you know I'm not Paul Harvey. All right, I'm right here at Powell's Distribution Center. I just left the training center. I started in the back at the training center. Now, I'm up here at the corporate office. See that Powell's, it says corporate office. And Powell passed away October 29th, 29th. Thursday, October 29th, and somebody's left him some roses right here. That's nice. See right here? Somebody left him some roses. That's for Powell. I know it is. See? That's, that's real thoughtful. Beautiful roses. Dozen roses. Rest in peace, Powell. My friend. Never met Powell. Uh, Fred Powell Barger. Even though his, uh, uh, I admire his restaurants, I admire his, admire his ideals. I respect, I love his restaurants. I love the food. Probably like everybody else. Like I said, I'm right here off Connor Rock Road. Sonya's over here in the car waiting on me. And this is the corporate office up front. I just left the training center in the back. I didn't even know that training center was down there. So I just learned something new. It's where they trained employees. And over here, I guess, is the distribution center, the corporate office. Because I, I see a, I guess that's what it is. It's, this semi stays backed up in here. I never see it move, so they might use it as a storage trailer backed into the loading dock. So I never see this one moved. Something good is cooking. I see a double big pile of cheese, which will make you say please. Double big pile of cheese will make you say please. Something good is cooking. Pal Sudden Service. www.palswell.com. All right, so this is it. I will walk up front. I figured they'd have all the flags flying at half staff since Pal passed away Thursday, but they don't. Looks like it's pulled all the way up. Sun's shining that way. This is the 1001 C. This is the corporate headquarters. Right here on Connor Rock Road. All right, I got a horror film, film to, to go make on this uh, Saturday, October 31st, 2020. I've got a horror film to make. Thanks for watching Big O's YouTube channel. Please like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Be happy, positive, and focused. If you ain't laughing, you ain't living. I'll see you in the next video, and always remember to do the right thing. Rest in peace, pal. Fred Powell Barger.